<clears throat> hey everybody, this is Grace. In this video, pardon my sound of my voice, I got allergies. But in this video, I'm going to talk about uh, narcissistic people and their flying monkeys. Now, how many of us remember when we were young, we first saw the Wizard of Oz? Did it scare you? It scared me. <laughs> it did. Um, those flying monkeys, the... What was it? Wicked, uh, Wicked Witch of the West, was it? Is that was her title? And her flying monkeys, you know, how unfair it was and how dangerous they looked as they, you know, did, went and did her bidding. But I've also known people to have those, you know, not literally have those flying monkeys, but you know what I'm saying. People in their lives um, that just go out and do whatever to protect that person. You know, that mean girl, really, when it comes down to it, the adult mean girl. And, uh, you know, the wicked witch. And they do whatever that one, you know, that one might not even tell them to do it. They just do it. And go out there and save her and, you know, take up for her. But it, I'm thinking about this because something that happened online a while ago, and it, and it wasn't something that... Actually, there was a flying monkey um, type person, but it made me think of that. And how the <clears throat> there are some people who get online and uh, online or in person. I've seen plenty in in person, but they will protect you know somebody who's really doing bad and uh, really putting out bad things, bad thoughts, uh, trying to do stuff like normalize narcissism. And, uh, and those who are, some would say some of them are fooled by that, that adult, the, the main one. They're fooled by them. Some, they're not. They're just as bad. They believe in the same kinds of things. And, uh, and so on. It's not just one type that becomes their flying monkey. And uh, will attack anybody. And these, are, these can be very charming people. Very charming people. And they know how to twist words to make them sound um, like that's how a person should think and what a person should do and um, how brave you are if you think that way whatever is the case they know how to twist the words they know how to manipulate people so. okay I want to stop a moment and mention something strange that just happened back in 2016 I had a had a composition book that I started writing notes on to write, make videos on these topics. And um, I had put it in my SUV, then Adam found it the other day underneath the uh, seat and put it back on the seat, back, you know, gave it back to me. I put it back on the seat. Well, I just opened it up to, <laughs> it was strange. I just opened it up and it opened up on a page from uh, September, September the 3rd of 2017 and the title was uh, Flying Monkeys <laughs> yeah that now right on that that is strange because that was probably just one time I mentioned it in those notes <laughs> and I thought it was weird weird things do happen coincidences do happen even that bizarre oh man my voice does not sound like me wow it's bad but um okay enough from real life happening but back to these flying monkeys and like I said something that was online and it just made me think that the topic that I had chosen what it was was this the topic I had chosen for a video um, somebody watched it okay and um, it's an older video I'm not gonna go into what it was but it made me um, you know checked it I checked it out to see you know and um, um, it just it wasn't something that it was you know somebody searched for that title but it made me think about that topic there are some people that who would do this thing of um, that that are against that topic and they might go and make videos against me you know I have seen things like that you know some people online you know wherever you can put videos they have little wars against one another it's not just YouTube <laughs> You know, they can fight, people can comment, make rude comments, even if they're, you know, they're supposed to be very supportive people. 
um, or not, or if it is these types of uh, fly, these types who are trying to put out there into the world, um, they are trying to normalize narcissism. They um, um, they will put out there in the world that whatever whatever is their behavior, whatever they're doing for themselves to promote themselves, you know, like either personally or as a group, uh, trying to teach people you need to become this way. This is the way it should be, and um, that anybody who goes against them, they, they jump on the, you know, gang. They gang up against them and uh, try to shoot them down, you know, because they're trying to normalize their self-centeredness, their, their narcissistic behavior. And they're, they're getting on board, you know, some, there's that one person, others are getting on board with it because they see how much it benefits them. So that's, a, you know, the flying monkeys can become this because they see, oh yes, too, if, you know, too, if I, um, you know, push it, put out there to the world that this is the norm, then it's going to greatly benefit me. You know, me, me, me. And anybody who goes against anybody tries to say, no, that's not right, we're gonna gang up on them, so. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and wrap this video up because I clicked on a button I think might mess up the whole video. But I did want to just uh, put out put that out there, you know, just to kind of, maybe some people haven't heard of flying monkeys. And, um, and believe it or not, I mean, that's what people call them. And I, I've always thought of it, I mean, I think I've thought of it as a long time since I was a child about how, you know, maybe so. You know, it's a long time ago whenever I watched it. I recently watched it again, I don't know, about a year ago maybe, more recent years, but anyway, I'm going to, you know, like I said, I probably messed this up, so I'll talk to you on another video, bye.